Hello fellow YouTubers, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance Blind. On the last episode, we, uh, headed over to, headed over to Sora's side of the Prankster's Paradise. On our way down, when we were dropping, we managed to get an A ranking, because that's pretty much all we focused on, was get there quickly. Uh, but we did, hooray! But, Prankster's Paradise is also different here, in which case we're not in Monstro. Yay, new area! Also, we saw a new character, uh, the Blue Fairy. <laughs> I mean, she's from Pinocchio, but she's new to Kingdom Hearts, so yay. But, yeah, Jiminy's around here. He doesn't know who we are, because he's Dream Jiminy. And, uh, technically this world is set pre-Kingdom Hearts, so he doesn't know who we are. But, Pinocchio mentioned a man in a black coat, and also mentioned us by name, because the man in the black coat said so. So, someone's here that knows who we are. Uh, but we kept on running into fake Pinocchios as we tried to look for him in this madness. Uh, we did see him wander off towards the Pleasure Circus, but we didn't end up finding him. Instead, we, we met up with a lot of, uh, a lot of Dream Eaters and Nightmares that we had to deal with. So, on this episode, uh, I feel like... We're about to we're about to see something that's gonna be awful, <laughs> just because there's a bunch of kids walking that way. Uh, they're not donkeys either. Hmm. I wonder what's I wonder what's gonna happen when I go up this this lift. Yeah. I guess we'll find out in just a moment. I guess I can't go any higher than this. I know I can. Is there a point? So long. Not really. I'm trying to see if any of these stars did anything. All right, let's see. We have what's ever in front of us. There's also a path. I mean, the path way at the beginning of this area that led towards the ocean side. We didn't really explore what that went to, but that might end up connecting to wherever we're going. Potentially, we'll see. I healed for no reason. <laughs> George is doing fine. I think we're gonna worry about possibly. I, I don't know how many. I don't know how many of these I need to. I need to worry about where. I guess George got the right disposition to get more things. We'll just have to see. Briarwood seems to be good. Gizmo, Gizmo does not. So I, I can only assume that Gizmo has yet to get it. So Gizmo might still have some stuff for us. We do have a brand new friend. And we have Bud. I'm not sure what Bud dismiss spirit. Uh oh, I don't want to press that button on accident. What does this do? What does this do? Oh, I'm just changing the page. But I don't know if we have everything from them. And then Eve is brand new. So we gotta see what she can do. <laughs> her disposition is chicken. Uh hey, at least our blizzard resistance is minus 40, so maybe the next time we run into next time we run into mimics, we might wanna just freeze them right is that what the negative number means it does more damage what'd you do huh what'd you do you're the one that we need to level up somehow get your disposition changed is there a point where your disposition just doesn't change anymore oh it doesn't like being poked anymore i'm so sorry I'm getting a lot of points all of a sudden. Keep going. Get that get that sixth heart. You're so close. There we go. We'll replenish that heart too. Alright, once again, we'll worry about that later. But Gizmo's there. Pinocchio! Jiminy! Help me, Jiminy! Oh, my star's above! We've got to do something! Okay, I got it covered. <laughs> oh, Pinocchio! Look at you! I think for now, you two better get out of here. I 
can knock bouncing foes away, huh? Oop. Oh, I, I, I tried to knock you away. Here, take that. Oh, you, you're just having the worst time. Oh, and he's going out flying somewhere. Oh, I'm up here now. Pinocchio's in the process of becoming... Becoming a donkey. That's not good. I need my aerial recovery. The sooner the better. Oh, you didn't even do nothing, anything that actually hurt me there. You're still alive? You're still alive. Where'd he go? It said I could knock him away, but so far it hasn't really... It must be a... Oop, it must be a reality shift thing I can do. Oh, I attacked you. I was like, where's Briarwood? Where are my friends? Am I alone? Why are my friends helping me here? Oh, boy. Okay, I just got, just got slapped. You know, you could just have fun spinning right there. Oh, please don't bounce anymore. We get him, we got him. You might be all that's left. Let's see how much health you have. Still half. Well, half of what you had. How are we going to save Pinocchio from this? Ooh, high jump. You again? Demnus? This isn't possible. My, my. A hollow puppet that's managed to grow a heart. Just imagine that. Pinocchio isn't anything like you nobodies. But if Pinocchio could be given one, shouldn't you be able to have a heart inside you too? <laughs> Maybe so. However... Do not forget that you yourself are not so very different from us. How am I anything like a nobody? That doesn't make any sense. Glossary, nobodies. A glossary entry that discusses nobodies. Organization 13. Glossary entry that discusses Organization 13. Oh, okay, let's read this chronicle. Mm -mm -mm. Also, Zenus is back. We we kind of called it last episode. Oh no. Now I think my my fears are gonna be in, my fears are gonna be uh revealed in the future. Let's see. Kingdom Hearts 2. Roxas woke up in his room in Twilight Town after having another strange dream. Only seven days left in his summer vacation, and he would be spending them with his best friends. But strange things began happening around him. White monsters called Dusks attacked. A key-shaped sword called the Keyblade materialized in his hand. On the last day of his vacation, Roxas remembered who he really was and what he had been trying to do. He found Sora sleeping in a pod and realized his summer vacation would have to end. With Roxas' demise, <laughs> the last of Sora's memories returned to him, and he woke from a year of sleep. It was a joyful reunion with Donald and Goofy, who had stuck by him all through his slumber. So wait, Roxas d died at the end of the prologue? Jiminy examined the journal a record of their last journey, but it was blank except for a single phrase, thank Nomine. With King Mickey's guidance, the group found their way to the mysterious tower, whose master, the sorcerer Yen Sid, alerted them to a new threat, nobodies, who served a group dressed in black coats known as Organization 13. So it was that Sora, Donald, and Goofy uh, set off on a new adventure. No uh, Goofy noise there. In Hollow Bastion, Sora was reunited with his old friends and learned that the Heartless were still causing trouble. While dealing with them and the nobodies, Sora had his first encounter with the organization since waking. I think the only one that got revealed at that point was Xemnas? I think they all stayed cloaked. But they were all talking. I remember that. <laughs> Do I remember that? 
While chasing his members from world to world, he learned that Kyra had been kidnapped by the organization back in Twilight Town, of course. On the second visit to Hollow Bastion, Sora and friends found themselves trapped inside a computer owned by Ansem the Wise. They repaired the program and returned to the real world, where they were finally reunited with King Mickey. And boy, did he have a surprise to share. Turned out that the Ansem Sora had fought and defeated was not really Ansem at all. Ansem the Wise had turned into an apprentice named Xehanort, who had turned into a Heartless. This Heartless stole his master's name, Ansem, while that nobody that was created in the process, Xemnas, became the leader of the organization. During an, epic, during an epic battle with the Heartless, Sora finally got a glimpse of this new adversary. So maybe we didn't see... Maybe we didn't see Xemnas' face until after the Battle of a Thousand Heartless. That's what this is saying. Sora's search for Kyrie brought him back to Twilight Town. By using the alternate version of the town where Roxas spent his summer vacation, Sora and the others found a way into the Realm of Darkness. However, along the way, they were ambushed by a horde of Dusks. Axel, one of the organization's members, came to the rescue and sacrificed himself to protect Sora, who was, in a way, also his best friend Roxas. At last, Sora had reached Organization 13's home world, the world that never was. He infiltrated the castle, leaving defeated Organization members in his wake, and finally found Kairi. He was also reunited with Riku, who had been transfigured into Ansem as a result of using the darkness within him. Thankfully, Riku's true form was restored. They met the real Ansem the Wise, who had assumed the name Diz, and whose blind quest for vengeance against the apprentices who had betrayed him had brought ruin to Roxas and countless others. Realizing the error of his ways, Ansem the Wise blew up the organization Kingdom Hearts as an atonement and was himself engulfed in blast. I engulfed in the blast. Atop the castle near what remained of Kingdom Hearts, Sora and the others confronted and defeated Xemnas. Namine opened a gateway home. Symbolically, she and Roxas accepted their place with Sora and Kairi, the people they had come from. As Sora and Riku tried to follow Kairi and the others out, the gate suddenly closed. Xemnas had survived, and Sora and Riku were flung into a final battle. They were able to dispatch Xemnas, but there was no escape from the Realm of Darkness. At the dark margin, they stared out to the sea, ready to give up, but then a letter and a bottle washed up. It was from Kairi. A door to the light appeared, leading them back to their home, the Destiny Islands, where all their friends were waiting. Not long after, Sora and Riku were watching the sunset when Kairi presented them with a letter she had found. Whatever was in the letter convinced the three of them that their journey was not over. <laughs> so, there was no escape from the Realm of Darkness, but a bottle washed up and a, an escape path was formed. Hmm. So, did Roxas die <laughs> when uh, Sora rewoke? Because this is Roxas' demise. Hmm. I mean, we didn't have to fight him again when we got back to the, the world that never was. Hmm. Symbolically. Okay, I was I was trying to find out where that where it mentioned Roxas again. So is, is Roxas is Roxas Ro Roxas is Roxas who Xemnas is talking about when he mentioned that we're not we're similar to a nobody just because he sees us as Roxas. What did he see Shion as? Did he just see Shion as us? I don't remember. I don't remember what his vision of Shion was. But hey, oh, okay, Pinocchio and Jiminy have, have run off now. They're kind of hiding. But Xemnas is back. Hooray! <laughs> to be fair, though, Xemnas was probably the most threatening. Well, at least it felt like he was the most threatening adversary we've had until Xehanort showed up and could not be beaten. I mean, the, the boss fight itself wasn't like, oh no, we can't defeat him ever. It was more, like in terms of danger, he seemed like he was, oh. Oh, that was an accident. Rampant fancy, is there anything in the outside that I should be able to pick up? Or is there anything higher up? Hmm. No, this doesn't look like it. 
I think we're good. I'm gonna pop one of these. Okay, so here's here's where I'm going with this. They put Ansem down here, but they haven't. I guess we need to finish the world before they put anyone else that got introduced in this world, huh? Since Ansem didn't show up until we defeated both versions of the City de Cloche. They're bringing back. They're bringing back the main villains, per se, of every game. In a way, they they brought back Ansem from one. They brought back Xemnas from two. Uh, Riku Replica from Chain of Memories. At least, I mean, Marluxia was the main villain, but Riku Replica was like the secondary main villain. If you want to, don't count Ansem either. Um. And then from Birth by Sleep, they have Vanitas, even though that really should be Xehanort, but he's coming back on his own. But that just leaves Coded in at least 358. With Coded, I mean, was there... Technically, the villain of Coded was Roxas. So if they're going to bring it back, if they're going to bring a villain from Coded, it would be Roxas, but I can also see them ignoring R Coded. Because, I mean, the only... Oh, actually, you know what? There are some other villains encoded. I mean, there's Maleficent and Pete. But I'm talking about, like, uh, unique characters. Like, not Disney characters. Like, everyone else. Uh, but from 358, I mean, the final boss was Shion. Would they bring her back? No one knows who she is. No one remembers who she is. They just remember that there's, like, someone that they forgot about. Hmm. Defeat all the spirits, achieve victory without using Y commands. Sure. I was hoping that slide didn't count. Oh, I also have high jump. I should equip that. Oh, I should have healed before I went into this thing, huh? Hey, I leveled up! Okay, the penguin needs to go, otherwise I have no chance. I feel like I could link, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do it just out of fear. So I can be paralyzed, I just can't uh, do anything with that. Also our friends are back, so they must have just been not been able to be in that last fight. Ooh. Sweet, we won. I think Briarwood got the last hit. Don't sit fancy in a block of chocolate. Heal. Needed that. Are you this level yet? No. Can you change your disposition, please? I have to see what I gotta see what you can turn into. I might have to switch Briarwood out. I thought I did. I did for I did for Riku. I didn't for Sora yet. Is this the best way to change this position? Oh, hey, there we go. I think you've gone through the entire loop now. I think you started a scrapper. Hmm. I mean, look, your eyes there are the original version. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about you. You? I think you're. I think you're good. Uh, in that case, it's the wrong thing. In that case. We'll just do this for now. I mean, we ha we already have everything for you unlocked. So we'll bring in Bud, who I think we still need to learn some stuff, and Eve, who we have yet to learn anything from. At least you're not giving me angry eyes. You need some help, though. Okay, good. I can't have you be a chicken. The green eyes, though. 
There's something about the green eyes and the black pupils. Ugh. Ha, see there. The spirit disposition has changed the spell slinger. New route open. All right, so I can do this with Bud. Ooh, ooh. Oh, you have two level things? Level 10, level 15. And link with spirit one more time. Hello? Oh, there's a secret here. Treasure magnet. What spells? Blindness block. Oh, that would help. Balloonra. I have no points for you, though. All right, we'll start leveling you up now. Everything should have stayed the same, right? Why did this say new? Why did it say new? D -d Didn't I have an attack boost? Maybe they have. Mm, maybe they have to be equipped to like, keep it. Confusion block. Light screen. There's no way. There's no way attack boost is new, is it? Hmm. Hmm. It could be. All right, let's go find out where Pinocchio and Jiminy went. There's been, a, there's been a lot of speculation that's happened over like the last several minutes. Okay, the, so there, there's nothing bad happening with the kids here. Good. Um, I guess we're heading off to the Oceanside Cliff area. I don't know where else they would go. I feel like the threat's already taken care of. We already we already ran into We ran into Mr. Cloak and Xemnas was there too, and then they were just like, okay, we're done here, we left. But why Why tell Pinocchio about us? Are they trying to sow discord in this world? Okay, that wasn't fair. It's a random random Sora name drop and all of a sudden everything goes haywire also I'm not sure if Sora's ever met that man before I'm still trying to think back to the the, the previous games where we had that cutscene that might have revealed them but yeah Nothing. I don't. I don't ever recall Sora meeting them. Ooh, I'm protected. Sweet. Oh, you know what? Whopper stop. Oh, you poor things. You might actually be. Never mind. I was about to say. Oh, what happened to the world? I was about to say. It seemed like they were getting protected from it but but that it just leaves them with like little to no health that ice didn't adhere to the floor oh that's a lot of oh none of them are gonna be happy with this huh Is there one that's invisible? No, that's George still. Oh boy. It'd be really nice to have a fire attack right now. Oh, I forgot I had to roll that. Everyone dead? Okay, we're good. Will we get a cutscene when we get outside, or are we just... Hmm? Hmm? Well, answered. Well, I hope they got home safe. Hmm? Ah! 
You must be Sora. Oh, yes, ma'am. And you must be the Blue Fairy. That's right. And I'm afraid that I have grave news. Good Geppetto went off to look for Pinocchio, and he was swallowed by a whale named Monstro. What? Have you told Pinocchio and Jiminy about it yet? Yes. And when I told them Geppetto was still alive inside the whale and at the bottom of the sea, those two little ones ran off at once. They're very determined to save him. But that's crazy. I've got to find them. <laughs> I thought she said she wasn't going to help them anymore. This monstro? I've heard of him, Pinocchio. He's a whale of a whale. Why, he, he swallows whole ships alive. And besides, it's dangerous. Why, I, uh... Goodbye, Jiminy. Goodbye. I may be live bait down there, but I'm with you. Ah. <laughs> you know what I never understood in the movie? How does Jiminy survive underwater? I mean, Pinocchio, I feel like, doesn't require air, because he's pu a puppet. But Jiminy's a cricket man. I think cricket men deserve, deserve need water. Not water, air. He was perfectly fine, though, in like the five minute scene that took for them to find Monstro. I blocked something. I don't know if it was actually anything worth it. Sure, I'm getting hit a lot. Thank God this isn't a one-hit HP run. <laughs> I feel like I should restart my uh, my playthrough of Kingdom Hearts 1 and just see if I can do it on the hardest difficulty. Can I do proud mode immediately on Kingdom Hearts 1? I think I could. <laughs> Not critical mode. I feel like critical mode is still outside of my play style. And then just the just the just the know how you need to do like one HP runs of this game. I don't think I could do it. I don't think I'd be able to do it. I mean we had we had like tasks in the in the encoded where it was like, don't get hit on this floor when we were going through some of the the system areas. But how many times did I fail those? How many times did I actually get hit? Oh, not again. I ran into this one. He was so happy with himself that he was like, oh, I hit him. There's a chest down there. We're not going to Monster out now, are we? I mean... Boy, that'd be... <laughs> not fair to Riku. Bud's all the way back there. But if you want to help. Can you quit going through staircases? Sweet. I think Bud is stuck. Bud! You doing okay back there? Oh, these guys just spawned in for no reason. Bud's in his 20s now. Nice. Hi. Hmm. I just looked at that and I thought it was one of my friends when I realized, oh, I don't have a frogman on my team. Is this like the, is this like the rare? Is this the rare one that we could find? 
Hmm. What's this? Cure boost. Another cure boost. Let's go with this one because we are we can unlock it. I can't tell from here, can I? Hmm. I can even look at my spirits. Oh, it's in the reports. So which one is this? Uh, oh boy. How do I tell you? I mean, we that's how you look like as a nightmare. We don't know what you look like as a normal spirit. Ribbity Bibbit, I challenge thee. Sure. Am I about to get it destroyed? Take out the Dream Eaters. Oh my god, look how much health you have! This 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 is a mistake. This is <laughs> this is a mistake. I'm gonna pay for it! Oh, this might help me. So he has a lot of health. And leveled up. Am I even hitting it? Did I hit it once? Where'd it go? Oh, please don't tell me he's healing himself. Okay, time bomb doesn't work on him. Uh-oh. Oh, you're going a ways away, huh? You're giving yourself a lot of barriers. Who did what? What'd I just do? I use another drop me not. I'm following him. I'm confused. Oh, he confused me with my control diverse. I'm glad I blocked whatever I did there. Boy, he's going a ways away. Did he leave? So was that a timed event? Because I chased him all the way down here. Oh, uh, it's probably a, he starts here and I have to do enough damage while he runs away before he actually leaves and kisses us goodbye. Kisses us goodbye. Oh, but boy, he had a lot of health. He had more health than uh, anything we've seen so far. He had, like. 12 bars of health. Because we fought him and didn't die, does it actually reveal anything new? I think God accidentally threw him. Oh, there's an enemy above us. Oh, so much for that. Oh, you respawn back up. Don't disappear. Oh, I should have known. Reappear. Coward. He's a coward. It might be a different type. New. No. 
I might actually do I might have to defeat it once in order to actually unlock whatever it shows. We were just lucky that it showed us what the Meow Wow rare thing is apparently. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to find it though. Hmm. Hmm. Also, we already have Char Clob Blaster Clobster here. And it's marked. All the other ones have been Usually doesn't mark it unless I actually defeat it both times. Which I think leads to the fact that I might not have to fight it as Sora. Hmm. Hmm. Got her items already almost at half. Alright, well we'll just worry about that later. Hold on. The entire reason I went to the reports in the first place was to see my treasures. Yikes, there's a place I'm missing. Okay. Okay. Mantra seems more and more likely now. We're underwater! Okay! Under the sea! I hope we see Ariel somewhere. Like, it doesn't make any sense, but I hope we see them. Take this. Yeah. Yeah. We've been underwater before. I mean, last time we were underwater, we had a... We looked like a, we looked like a mermaid. I wonder what Sora's thinking right now. Like, boy, this place feels familiar yet different. There's a lot of there's a lot of oxygen in the air. Oh, I have floaty physics right now. Okay. You know what? I'm just thankful they didn't slow me down. They could have totally had like my speed at like 50%. No, 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 no. You don't get to lob those at me. Oh, boy. Okay, hold on. There's an upper path. There's a lower path. But uh, Eve's way back there for some reason. That leads where I need to go. Doing good. Panacea. Wonder if there's because I can jump higher. I wonder if there's any goodies higher up. Oh, yep. Uh huh. Look at this. Lofty fantasy. Take damage no more than two times. Well, see, there's one of those tasks that I could definitely fail. Why do I time bomb and then drain dive the same person? What's this lead to? Oh, that's like a shortcut that shows that there's something there. Oh. That puts me in a flow motion. Uh-oh. I think that's pointing me in the direction I need to go. Not the direction I want to go right now. I'm still looking for... I'm frozen! I'm still looking for everything I need to get. Boy, I cannot wait till I get, like, frozen... Resistance. You know what I should do? I should make a penguin friend. I bet they come with frozen resistance. Why wouldn't they? There's a giant open area here. Probably has plenty of things to do. There's a giant man ray over there. Sing ray. Man ray. <laughs> ma 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 Getting separated from the rest of your group. <laughs> George is having a picnic with them. I 
mean, there's a chest right here. Are you gonna be like another Dream Eater that has like a boss fight behind it? Sky blue paint. Did I press the screenshot button? I guess I might have accidentally touched it. Sweet. <laughs> that, if you want to see a picture of the menu, I uploaded it to Xbox Live, apparently. Oh, look at this chest. Hidden away. Another Zero Gravira. I'm missing five. They might be in the next room. Okay, before I head to the next area, though, I have to see what 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 you do. Well, that was boring. Once again, my movement might be upgraded from the original 3DS version, so that might have been needed to get over here. Where I clearly didn't need it here. If there's a shop, there's a store. I could potentially finish this place off. I mean, there's... I don't know if there's a boss fight. There has to be like a... And we're going further down. Unless the boss fight is Monstro itself. I go down. There's another door in the other area. Hmm. I kind of want to continue on. Boy, am I glad I grabbed under that ledge. This is a different area? Okay, so they had a map of the new area, or the previous area. Take this. Back off. Quit, quit, no, <laughs> don't. I need to lock on and switch to a different enemy. Oh boy, that's a drop. I don't want to fall yet. Oh, well, I'm falling anyway. Let's not go that way. I'm busy looking for chests. Can you point me to the nearest chest? It's taking a lot to get Eve's divinity up, or at least, you know, um, hey, we leveled up. Eve's link is not going up with the rest of everyone. I mean, George's, I bet George's pop up, like, this is like the third time it's maxed out. What is this? Oh, another, another eel. <laughs> eel? What am I talking about anymore? How does that look like an eel? I don't know if I got experience with that last fight. Oh, that was an accident. I didn't see this one. Shield cookie two. I'm looking at the door. The door's right there. That's the exit. There's one chest left. And it should be in this room, because I've gotten everything else here. Tatsu Steed recipe. Mmm.
Claw my way past, then rescue my friends. Chill, Claw Basher. Oh, God! Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so attacking him from the front seems like a horrible idea. Yeah. Look at that big map. There's nothing new here. Also, Sora, should we really be that afraid of what what's going to happen with Jiminy and Pinocchio getting eaten by Monstro? Where do you think we found them the first time? I mean, we found we found Jiminy with the book. Okay, so how do I fight you? If you do your claw blades thing at us, okay, you have a lot of health. Or someone behind him. Okay. I feel like this shouldn't be working how it is. <laughs> wow, his hitbox is like incredibly small compared to the rest of his body. Hey, we finally got crushed by him. Oh, we just switched out George for someone else. Okay, he, he moves very fast. Boy, I cannot hit his hitbox. It's just his mouth. I'm stuck. <laughs> Oh. I guess I can't block a giant thing landing on top of me, huh? Might be bad for me. Uh-oh. Desperation move time? That's a desperation move time! I have no clue what he's doing. Oh. His desperation move changes the layout of the floor. What are you doing way over down there? Well, he's still in the middle of it. Okay, get off the platform. Get off the platform. Uh-oh. Yeah, you can attack Mantra all you want. Oh, please don't tell me he's like this for the rest of the fight. He might be like this for the rest of the fight. Oh no, there he goes. He's back to normal now. Yeah. 
Alright, I can't be in the air when he goes in the air. Trying to block it. Help, give me past his arm. As long as I only have to block one direction, I don't have to block like on top of me and behind me at the same time. I can block it. Okay, this is a bad spot. This is a bad spot. I don't want him to do his desperation stuff again. So if we can kill him before that happens. Destroy the ice holding monster. Okay. No more fights. Uh, <laughs> we're not fighting you anymore. We're fighting monster itself. I went the wrong way. At least we're safe this way, because he should be chasing us, what, this way? I have no idea where it is. Oh, Kaiju fight! Bubble burst command. All right, I'm gonna walk up right next to you. Oh, you better good running from me. Oh, you are in danger, my friend. Oh, your poor little beams aren't doing anything. I get it now. After this, Pinocchio and Jiminy's world gets dragged into darkness. And they end up cast into the sea between worlds, along with Monstro. And then, they end up in Traverse Town and the belly of the whale. That's when we meet for real. It's like Master Yen Sid said. I'm in the dream, Pinocchio's world is dreaming. And that world will never be right again until it wakes from sleep. gear. Keyblade that triggers fewer reality shifts, but compensates with an extra boost in strength and magic. Is it the same? Yeah, it should be the same Keyblade, right? Where are they? I've turned this castle upside down. Hey, are the other two still out cold? Dylan and Evan are conscious again but still unstable. They're resting inside. Gotcha. 
Well, I guess I'll give the castle grounds a sweep. Don't. If they were back, we would have found them by now. Hmm. So do you think they were blasted off to some other world, or what? I highly doubt it. When someone who's lost their heart is recompleted, they should return to the place where it happened. And if that world is unavailable for whatever reason, a refuge is made for them in the realm between, a world called Traverse Town. They would be sent there. Or perhaps... No, look. Okay. The fact is, we're here. We've been recompleted, right? So they should be here too. Plain and simple. I agree, it is strange. <sighs> what a drag. Could they not have been recompleted at all? Well, you see... Uh... That, forget it. You know what? I'll bring him back myself. Huh? How, exactly? Why do I always get stuck with the icky jobs? DTD. Was that the thing that, oh, was that the cutscene that they were mentioning that that explains why this should be going after? <laughs> Because wasn't the DTD the giant machine that we got trapped in? Which which was where Tron World was? That would make sense. Oh, Tron World's already a cinch at this point. Because we did the harder world first. We still don't know. Okay, so. They're just as confused as we are as to where the others went. We did. We did kill them all, correct? Was there any that got away? I don't know. I think they all died. I mean, Larkseen, Larkseen was killed in Chain of Memories. Demix was killed. Boy, I don't remember. Was Demix killed before the Battle of a Thousand Heartless? Was that the fight he died in? Luxord, I think, was part of that, like, giant boss rush mode that we had at the end of the world that never was. Where there was just, like, all those random doors. And that's where we ended up killing, like, most of the rem remnants. Uh, who else was not there? Psyx was part of that. Huh. And Zigbar Brig. I mean, we had the snipers match that we had with him. I honestly don't remember if he died, died. I feel like he did, though. Hmm. Well... It's almost been an hour. We did it. Hooray. So, yeah, of course. Uh, Monstro ate Mickey. Mickey. Monstro ate Pinocchio and Jiminy. And gonna then Riku deals with them inside. But in the real world, we eventually meet it back up with them in Kingdom Hearts 1. We still haven't equipped high jump. Oh, well. On the next episode, I think we'll go in with Sora first. And we'll head over to the grid, the Tron world. I need to watch Tron for the first time. I also need to rewatch Tron Legacy to get uh, get me back up to speed. Because apparently that might have to deal with more Tron Legacy stuff than Tron stuff. But I mean, <laughs> we played in the first Tron world and I still hadn't seen Tron then. So I need to make up for that. So, until next time. Hopefully you enjoy. <laughs>